Hello everybody, my name is ZeldaBlade20 and I'm bringing you a new video. Well, actually this one is in English, normally I do Dutch videos, this time it's in English. Because this is actually about, um, yeah, Sky Server's Pixelmon, which is a great server that I actually want to share with you guys. Um, yeah, we are actually standing in my house and that's actually kind of boring. I really didn't want to do that, so... Um, let's just go to spawn and actually explain some stuff because everybody's waiting for some uh, explaining and i can't type for crap today thank you okay so here we are at spawn and this is actually where you will start your great adventure before you enter the server the ip of the server is in the description the link where you can download pixelmon is also in the description we're using currently version 3.1.4 if it's going to be updated, you can read it on the forums, and the link to the forums is also in the description. So a lot in the description. Don't forget to um, yeah check that out because otherwise you will have a hard time joining, and we don't actually uh, uh, want that. We want you to have an easy time, of course, with enjoying this server and uh, joining this server, of course. So when you are actually standing here, this is actually where you start. You can actually do kit tools, and you will get a golden shovel, some pokeballs, and the golden shovel is very important to claim your territory, which I will talk about later. Yeah, so much explaining to do, it's just so annoying, no, just... I bet, I'd rather actually explain it that the, then you actually come into the server like, uh, Hi, here I am, what do I have to do? So, um, yeah, that's actually the first thing that you want to do. Of course, read the rules, very important. This is actually a tutorial on how to get, uh, how to make your own Pokeballs and... Well, you can also buy them, but I will actually save that for a little bit later. This is about uh, rules that you can see right over here. Um, more rules over here, of course. We have the staff member if you have any questions. Legendaries, of course, will spawn. Um, the shrines, for people that actually don't know or do know. Uh, shrines that are um, things like my, that you need for legendary birds. Pokemon like Zapdos, Articuno and Moltres. These are disabled, just because they are a little glitchy and they can actually mess the server up. So... Those Pokemon are not in here as well, just keep that in mind. Okay, so before I'm going to leave sh um, shop, <laughs> well it's actually a big shop as well. Before I'm going to leave spawn, uh, you can have uh, the shop here, you have a lot of items like dirt, stone, sand. So if you need extra money and you're mining for iron or anything like that, or building your house and you have some leftovers that you actually don't need anymore, instead of throwing them away, you can actually sell them here to get some money or you can buy it if you are just thinking of, well I'm not going to get any cobblestone, I will just buy it right here. I mean, why not? Uh, it's possible, and why not as a Pokemon? So, as you can see, there's a lot of stuff that you can actually buy here. But of course, with Pokemon, it's very important. Portment? It's very important. I can't speak for damn, they do repair. It's very important, of course, that you know how to buy or make your Pokeballs. Well, here we have some Pokeballs, and if I just click on it, it says that I bought 16 uh, Pokeballs, and as you can see, I have them in my inventory right here. So, yeah, you have all kinds of balls, and I will actually show you that later, because I have my own shop. So, um, before I'm actually going, there's one more thing that I want to show you. Uh, there's also a voting system in the server. Voting is uh, that uh, the server actually is uh, known better. Uh, it doesn't actually have any requirements. Just like, yeah, I like this server. You just have to vote, put your Minecraft name in it and select vote. That's all that you have to do. And for that you get rare candies, Pokeballs, uh, no, not Pokeballs, Ultra Balls. And money and six, no, uh, you get two diamonds, two rare candies for each vote or something like that. I, <sighs> I know what you get. You get... <sighs> You get two Ultra Balls, two rare, 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 rare candy, two diamonds, 250 in-game cash, and a vote token. Two vote tokens. I'm sorry, you get two vote tokens. And with those vote tokens, you can actually um, open the mystery chest and there will be more items in it. And one time it's actually kind of sad that there's almost nothing in those. But on the other hand, you can actually get a lot of items. So it's a sort of a gamble, but it's free stuff. And we are not complaining about free stuff, because free stuff is awesome. Yay for free awesome stuff. So with the voting thing out of the way, there is a lot of warps that you can go to. I'm just going to my own shop for a sec, so I can actually uh, show you um, yeah, around. This uh, here is my shop, as you can see. It's just a welcome sign. You can actually, this is the ball section. You can buy Pokeballs, Great Balls, Ultra Balls, Friend Balls, Level Balls. Dust balls and master balls, the balls are a nerd. And before you go into ask, no, we don't have dragon balls. That didn't make any sense. I don't care if it makes sense. I'm here to show you around. So, yeah, you can make your own shops. Uh, well, 
yeah, you need a rank for it, the donation rank, if you really want to make the shops as I did. But that's a funny thing, it's not really necessary to donate. You can actually enjoy the server as well without donating, and that's what I really like about this, um, yeah, this server a lot. So yeah, here we can uh, have the evolution stones and all that stuff. As you can see, um, here we have diamonds and rare candies. And uh, a lot of people actually are building houses here as well. So this is really starting to be a little village here right now. Uh, as you can see, there's a lot of people that actually build around here and that's actually kind of cool. Uh, this is my arena right here with Pikachu and Eevee, best friends forever. Uh, because uh, it's a friendly server, we really want to um, get everybody to get along, of course, because... Well, friends are something precious and that's really important, so that's why I built those two pixel arts. Um, Anyway, before I'm going to, um, before you're going to think that's uh, creative mode, there is no creative mode here in uh, Pixelmon. Uh, so, if you want to build something like this, you're going to need a lot of time and a lot of items. Just saying. But anyway, is this all protected? That's really important that you can, uh, if yeah, all your builds are protected. Well, remember the golden shovel I was talking about? The golden shovel is really important for that. As you can see, if I'm selecting gold shovel. The game actually tells me that I have 13,832 more blocks that I can claim. You don't start off with that huge number, I'm just way too long already on the server, who cares? Um, what you can do with that is you can right click a corner and you can actually see if it's claimed already. That is claimed with all those golden blocks. They are not actual golden blocks, they are just for looks golden blocks, to be honest. Because if I click here, that's actually another claim of me. But I'm going to give a small tutorial how to claim stuff and how to do that. Sorry for that random cut there, though actually something went wrong, uh, whatever. Um, anyway, about the protection, if you protect something and you put a sign on a wooden door with uh, saying uh, private, you can't enter, uh, well, just private. Um, I will actually show you this on how that actually works. But I can't open these, well, other can't open these doors. I think I can open this door because I'm a staff member, I'm a moderator. But I'm not abusing my powers because no staff member ever abused powers in this server. So, don't worry about that. And the sign that I was talking about with wooden doors, um, if you use just this, yeah, okay, this is the Link Ultra's place, but just your name with uh, private like that above it and nobody can actually enter your door. That's a good thing. Because somebody, well, I think everybody wants to have some privacy. And of course, I'm falling here down in this water that I can't get out of. <laughs> wanna get out, wanna get out, wanna get out, wanna get out, wanna get out. Thank you. So, about claiming. There is a snipe here that I want. Um, I only have my 100 with me. Uh, snivy. Just snivy. I want to catch you. Um, okay, so I saw. Uh, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? Um, you know what? I'm just going to throw a level ball at it because my Pokemon is level 100, Snivy is level 13, full health. I think I have a good chance of catching it with full health. Of course not. Okay, I'm going to try it one more time. Go level ball and use it to actually catch that Snivy. Okay, it was really disturbing. I'm very sorry about that. Come on, stay in your ball. Don't do growth. Rope is pointless. Well, actually, it raises your special attack, but it wastes its attack at the same time. I just want to capture you! I don't know, am I going to make a film montage out of that? No, I don't want to make that. That's no fun. Okay, I captured it. Good. No film montage. Yay! Lediba, you saw what happened. So I'm just going to ignore you. I'm going to give the tutorial about claiming your, gra uh, your, your ground, your, your build, your stuff, your thing that you actually made. Okay, so for example, I love this tree. I love this tree more than ever. Oh, tree, you are so treesome. Okay, I just had to say that instead of handsome, I know, and whatever. Anyway, everybody can actually chop down this tree. But if I right claim here, you can actually see some diamond blocks over here. Remember, those are not real diamonds. This is just an indicator that you actually uh, claim the corner. And then you want to go to an opposite corner. It has to be at least 10 by 10 blocks. And if you right click, you can actually see a small square. Everything in this square is protected. So, the only one that actually can destroy this tree is me. And that rhymes for some reason. I don't know why. But that was just for the tutorial, so I'm just going to say I don't need this claim anymore, so I'm just going to say Abandon Claim. And when I... Of course I typed it wrong, right? Abandon... Okay. 
complain. Why? A pen don't complain. Uh, I can't type. See, that's my problem. I can't type. Well, anyway, if you are new to Pixelmon, there's a lot of stuff that you can do with your Pokémon. For example, if you have a flying type, well, so most of the flying types, I should say. For example, Charizard. It's a starter Pokémon, so you can actually start with a Charmander and you will have your own Charizard. If it's a Charizard, you can right-click it with an empty hand and you can fly around. You don't need to come and fly or uh, the HM fly. You can just fly around and you can actually see that you are um, going on your Pokémon and that's... That's really amazing, I really enjoy this. I really enjoy this. If I'm pressing F5, you can actually see me riding my Pokemon. That looks amazing. I mean, look at this! Look at this, I'm just flying on my Pokemon. I have to say the controls are a little bit awkward. Uh, you have to get used to that. For example, uh, space of course brings you up. Um, instead of turning, I can just turn and actually look backwards. If you want to turn your Pokemon, you have to use the... Uh, W uh, A S D buttons for it, so yeah, I really enjoy that. And of course, there is a lot of events that we have as well. I'm just going to take you to Skyhop for a sec. Uh, warp Skyhop, and if you go over here, sometimes there are events that somebody uh, is throwing. Well, one of the staffs done throwing uh, an event. If you complete an obstacle course like this, or there is a quiz or anything like that, you can actually get some free items. For example, if I well, yesterday I actually made that, that if anybody could make this obstacle course, they will be rewarded with a Master Ball. And two of them actually made it, and the other five were sent to quizzes. We just put in random questions, and the first one actually answered the correct one, wants the Master Ball. So, really nice. So, we also have Drop Party, so if I'm going to Warp Drop... This is actually the place where drop parties are being organized and all these droppers that you can see in the ceiling, I know it's kind of ridiculous, will all hold items and when there is a drop party one is actually switching one switch and it will drop a lot of items. So there's a lot of stuff that you can do here. And of course there are so many um, regions where different Pokemon, uh, well biomes, not regions, sorry. I, I play too much Pokemon, I'm sorry. There's just so much that you can do. And to end this video off, I'm going to have a little battle. So I'm just going to my battle arena, ZP battle. And I'm going to call in um, Sergeant Killer. And that's going to... Yeah, we're going to have a battle. So I'm just going to prepare stuff and I will see you after the cut that... Uh, and if uh, it's ready and... I will see you in a sec. Okay, I'm just going to look away from the screen because I'm going to have a battle with um, Sergeant Killer. And what I'm usually do is I'm just going to press random the buttons and I'm stopping randomly. And which Pokemon do I have to start with? A legendary. Or Sergeant Killer. I don't actually don't want to do that, but that really matter. Okay, well, ready, set and go. Set go. Okay, come on, try your Pokemon. Try your Pokemon. I'm ready. Try a Pokemon, there we go, okay, and it's a, okay, except, I don't know what it is, oh, I mean, oh, this, this is a good thing, okay, Hydro Pump, okay, now let's see, oh, now it's a Dragonite, well, that actually is a dumb idea, because I have Ice Beam, that's not really, sm okay, you do a lot of damage because of that, 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 Attack. And I think Sergeant really did EV training on uh, speed, so I am a little worried here. So now it's Crocodile. What is, what is a Crocodile? I'm. I'm. Uh, okay, it's a Dark Ground type. Oh, you can do. Oh, great. Now I'm in big trouble. Um, I'm going for Kinky Height. Uh, that's actually a Dutch Pokemon that I use there. And um, I'm going for, I think, Earthquake. I hope it will be super effective. Outrage. Earthquake. Well, it was not super effective. I don't have Quick Attack, damn it! Oh, Muddy Water. Yeah, I'm, I'm screwed. I'm screwed. Ow. The pain. Okay, so the problem that I have at this moment is I can use Dark Knight and... Uh, I'm just going for Fire Flame. The Crocodile is... Being a crook in my butt. Well, it's a real crook, let's put it that way. Okay, uh, Fire Blast is not uh, really accurate, so I'm going for Flamethrower, hopefully it finishes off. 
Oh, you're confused. Ah, you're confused and now you're fainted. Neener, neener, neener. Okay, so. Okay, I'm waiting. Oh, now we have Scissor? That's actually a really... Whatever, flamethrower. Why did you use Scissor? Why? Sergeant, seriously, if you're watching this video, why did you use... Oh, okay, I can actually try and... You know what I'm doing here, wait. I missed though, I missed! Oh, frick, frack. Okay, so now I actually have a problem because the only Pokemon that I have left is the Dark Knight, Psycho, and Voltaire. Voltaire doesn't stand a chance to that. So Psycho actually could do that. Yeah, those are named after the Pokemon. Whatever. So I think, um, yeah, I will go with the Dark Knight. Hopefully he can actually do something. Psycho Beam doesn't really do a lot, so. Maybe I can paralyze it. That would be cool. Okay, you're recharging. Can I please get a paralyze? Please! Nope, I can't. Okay, I'm going to use Psycho and I'm going to use uh, Psychic. Why not? That should finish it off. Okay, critical hits. Maybe I actually should have done that in the first place. Who cares? A Chandelure. Uh, that's a Ghost Dark... Is that a Ghost Dark type? It is. YOLO! That's what everybody's saying. Let me yes, uh, Shadow Ball, I'm screwed. Okay, Voltaire, you are my final hope. This is actually my first Pokemon that I started the server with. It's very special, so I'm just going to use Thunder Wave to play it on the safe side. Shadow Ball will be done. Oh, dang it. Okay, I need to have luck. Come on, Thunder! I think that Gengar is faster than my Jolteon. Uh, discharge. No! Good game. <laughs> Sergeant, you made me cry. I hope you're happy. Yeah, I know. You have the sunglasses. Deal with it. Okay, okay. Thank you very much. You were a very worthy opponent. But next time, I will probably lose again. Ta da Okay, so um, yeah, if all your Pokemon are fated or one Pokemon or you just want to heal your Pokemon, just go to one of those healers, right click it and your Pokemon will be healed. So with that, I hope I gave you enough information about how the server actually works. If you have any questions about the server, you can leave comments uh, in the comment section of course with your question and I will actually take a look at it if I can see that, uh, if I actually can answer it. Uh, you can also answer, uh, ask them in the server if you are in the server. That's really no problem. I love that Eevee and Pikachu best friend forever. Yay! Without that. Anyway, if you have trouble with installing Pixelmon, just go to Google. There are a lot of tutorials there. I can't answer all those questions because for me it works fine. And I actually see a lot of problems with some people that are just having the wrong version. And I'm really saying just Google that because, yeah... If it's not working, then it's probably something you didn't do right. So then I would really suggest to use actually a, a guide or a tutorial or a, yeah, just Google. So with that was my phone. I can't help it. Sorry, that was my phone, and it actually has to say to me that I lost a battle. Thank you very much, phone. Well, anyway, with that, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Hope to see you in uh, yeah, Sky Server's uh, Pixelmon. I will be there, all these people will be there, and with that I'm going to sign off. So thank you all for watching, uh, leave a like if you have the time for that, uh, that would be really appreciated. And if you enjoy the server, feel free to um, tell your buddies about it, that uh, you are actually are in a server from Pixelmon. Well, you can, you don't have to, right? Anyway, with that I'm just going to sign off. So, Bye guys! I'm just going to rant longer because I'm probably now wasting time. No, I'm not going to waste your time. Bye! Thanks for watching!